What is traded in Forex? The simple answer is money. Specifically, currencies. Because you're not buying anything physical, Forex trading can be confusing so we'll use a simple, but imperfect, analogy to help explain. Think of buying a currency as buying a share in a particular country, kinda like buying shares in a company. The price of the currency is usually a direct reflection of the market's opinion on the current and future health of its respective economy. In Forex trading, when you buy, say, the Japanese yen, you are basically buying a share in the Japanese economy. You are betting that the Japanese economy is doing well, and will even get better as time goes. Once you sell those shares back to the market, hopefully, you will end up with a profit. In general, the exchange rate of a currency versus other currencies is a reflection of the condition of that country's economy, compared to other economies. Major currencies While there are potentially lots of currencies you can trade, as a new forex trader, you will probably start trading with the major currencies. They're called major currencies because they're the most heavily traded currencies and represent some of the world's largest economies. We just consider all eight currencies as the majors. Below, we list them by their symbol, country where they're used, currency name, and cool nicknames. What is Forex trading? Forex trading is the simultaneous buying of one currency and selling of another. Currencies are traded through a Forex broker or CFD provider and are traded in pairs. Currencies are quoted in relation to another currency. When you trade in the Forex market, you buy or sell in currency pairs. Imagine each currency pair constantly in a tug of war with each currency on its own side of the rope. An exchange rate is the relative price of two currencies from two different countries. Exchange rates fluctuate based on which currency is stronger at the moment. There are three categories of currency pairs. The majors. The crosses. The exotics. The major currency pairs always include the US dollar. Cross currency pairs do not include the US dollar. Crosses that involve any of the major currencies are also known as minors. Exotic currency pairs consist of one major currency and one currency from an emerging market, EM. Major currency pairs. The currency pairs listed below are considered the majors. These pairs all contain the US dollar, USD, on one side and are the most frequently traded. While there are eight major currencies, there are only seven major currency pairs. The majors are the most liquid in the world. Liquidity is used to describe the level of activity in the financial market. In Forex, it's based on the number of active traders buying and selling a specific currency pair and the volume being traded. The more frequently traded something is the higher its liquidity. For example, more people trade the euro to US dollar currency pair and at higher volumes than the Australian dollar to US dollar currency pair. This means that euro to US dollar is more liquid than Australian dollar to US dollar. Major cross currency pairs or minor currency pairs. Currency pairs that include any two of the major currencies except the US dollar are known as cross currency pairs or simply as the crosses. Major crosses are also known as minors. While not as frequently traded as the majors, the crosses are still pretty liquid and still provide plenty of trading opportunities. Don't confuse minor currency pairs with the seven major currency pairs, all of which include the US dollar against one of the seven other most liquid currencies in the world. The most actively traded crosses are derived from the three major non-USD currencies, Euro, JPY, and GBP. An exotic currency is a currency from countries with developing or emerging markets. Exotic currency pairs are made up of one major currency paired with the currency of an emerging economy, such as Brazil, Mexico, Chile, Turkey, or Hungary. Basically, an exotic currency pair includes one major currency alongside an exotic currency. Due to the overall lower degree of liquidity, exotic currency pairs tend to be far more sensitive to economic and geopolitical events. For example, a political scandal or unexpected election results can cause an exotic pair's exchange rate to swing violently. 
So if you want to trade exotics currency pairs, remember to factor this into your decision. Let's summarize what you've learned in a series of questions. What is a currency pair in Forex? A currency pair is a pairing of currencies where the value of one is relative to the other. For example, pound sterling to US dollar is the value of the British pound relative to the US dollar. What are the major currency pairs? Major currency pairs, majors, are those that include the US dollar and are the most frequently traded. There are seven of them, euro to US dollar, US dollar to Japanese yen, pound sterling to US dollar, US dollar to Canadian dollar, US dollar to Swiss franc, Australian dollar to US dollar, and NZD slash USD. What are the currency crosses? Currency crosses, crosses, are the more frequently traded currencies that do not include the US dollar in their pairing. Crosses include euro to pound sterling, euro to Canadian dollar, pound sterling to Japanese yen, euro to Swiss franc, euro to Japanese yen, etc. How many currency pairs exist? There are hundreds of currency pairs in existence but not all can be traded in the FX market. The United Nations currently recognizes 180 currencies. If you were to pair each currency up with another, it's a lot.